in the garage this should be hopefully a fun quick one um lots of you seem to like the creed out there so we're gonna do another one uh if you're new to the channel subscribe down below check out our playlist section on our channel we also have a couple other creed songs some 90s alice chains voices kind of stick to what we like to know uh standard tune today e-a-d-g-b-e we say that all the time so um let's get right into this i uh, love the opening intro verse section of it Tremani, that's why I kind of doing some Creed songs around here. So we're going to start off on the E, 9, 7 to the A, heavy palm mute three times. And then we're just going to slide up here from the 7th to the 6th of the A. I mean, from the 6th, 7 to the 6th. Still palm mute and heavy. And then we're going to go back to that 7, back to the 6th. Open on the A, and then open on the A and D, and then we're gonna come down here to the 11 of the D. So. When we come down here to the 11 of the D, we're actually gonna strum that four times. Once on the nine, twice on the 11 again, and then a slide to the 14, still in that, all in that D. Um, the way I've caught him playing it, he tends to bend that 11 of the D and then slide on down to the 14. Intermediate, new, beginner, you don't have to do that. You just, just slide if you want. So that's up to you as a player how you want to do it. So all together. Then we're just going to slide up to an E power chord, mute not that top E there. We're gonna be on the seventh of the A, ninth of the D, muting out the rest. Seven, uh, seven, eight down strums. Pretty much play most of the song with down strums. To the B power chord, just muting out the top B still. Now we're here on the second of the A and the fourth of the D. On the last strum that, make sure you hold that A. And slide down all the way to that seven so you get that sound. And that's the entire in, uh, intro verse and then uh, the second verse also. So it takes you through that. Of uh, course, I, I was taking this off the Woodstock 99 kept coming up and that's where I was listening to it and kind of got me wanting to play this and end up doing this song. Anyways, um, and I noticed he uh, didn't do the harmonics, but there's harmonics, if I remember correctly, on the album where I just want to say it's at just above the fret there on the third. And we're just playing power chords there, doing the B, muting out that top B again, and then second and the fourth. And we're coming up here to the F minor, second and the fourth again, but now we're on the E and the A. Come here down to, what is it, C minor, or C, yeah, C sharp or whatever, uh, which is gonna be the fourth here on the A, and the sixth on the uh, G, uh, D, sorry. And then just move it up one here, E, A, fourth, sixth again. And that takes you verse, chorus, verse, chorus. And there's kind of a middle section. And he uses a lot of wah. And it honestly just sounds like he's kind of playing out the same chorus lines, but just with the wah. And then there goes to a part where he adds like a phaser and a delay and a bunch of other stuff. And that's where I'd almost recommend maybe using the bar chords of these so you can play like the bottoms. It sounds like he's uh, kind of arpeggiating between them. So like the... 
we'll come down here to the seventh and then bar it all the way across and then on the ninth we'll be at the a and the d and then at the g here we're going to be at the eighth <laughs> doing the same thing and then So kind of takes you through the whole song. I don't really think I missed any of the parts. If I did, as usual, you guys will tell me down below. You guys are great about that. And uh, as usual, having fun here in the garage. Hope you're having fun out there. Stay safe as usual. We'll see you soon.